Welcome back. Today, McAllen Mayor Jim Darling gave a State of the City address focusing on the future of the city. CBS 4's Imelda Mejia was there and tells us what to expect. The 2016 McAllen State of the City address started off with a bang. As McAllen Mayor Jim Darling entered with a group of children and veterans, both part of what Darling would like the city to emphasize for 2016. We thought this was a very important uh, vision was, you know, everybody matters and making sure we uh, provide for the people that need uh, special help from us and uh, make sure our programs Everything we do recognizes that. Mayor Darling met with some of the homeless advocates this year to find ways to better help that community. We need to develop with the workforce, develop a program where we give a homeless or dignity by working, but recognizing the limitations of that population. Those over at the Salvation Army in McAllen say they have on average 45 to 60 people who spend the night. And Captain Melendez says the Salvation Army provides more than just a meal and a bed. We're, we're always on the lookout to while the person, the individual, the family is here, how can we help them to get back on their feet, go back into society, find a place to live and continue a normal life? So Looking towards the future, the Salvation Army is working on possibly opening a community center to better provide services and programs to those in need. Say we have a major disaster. Um, the, the room space that we have here won't be able to shelter more than maybe 150, but with this community center, full court gym, uh, we'll be able to add another almost 150 cots to a situation like that. So Captain Melendez says he hopes the city of McAllen will be able to include the community center project in their plans for the future. In McAllen, Imelda Mejia, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. Anyone that would like to see what projects the city of McAllen worked on in 2015 can find the year in review on the city's website.